Hi, I'm Leslie Logan. I'm here in my Pilates Haven, and we are continuing our series with the C-Shaper. Um, last week, we talked about how the 100 can be done in here and um, why this is so useful as a tool. Um, the next exercise I want to show you is the roll-up, which I kind of, it's like a half roll-up, um, but, you know, what this really teaches people and myself is what part of our body are we not articulating up? Are we just coming off in one big piece or we're missing all together? So it's not that you like one bone at a time is not the best cue. It's more like you just peel off, right? Like when you peel off a fruit roll up off of a wrapper, it just kind of comes off. It doesn't go inch, inch, inch. I mean, you hope, you hope it doesn't. So same thing here. When I bend, I just want to be able to bend evenly. Um, and the C shaper really helps with that. So put my feet down, I squeeze my legs and everything together, just like I would in my roll up. I reach my arms forward. Before I begin, I make sure that I have the longest line and I'm already touching the C shaper. And then I'm going to peel off. So for me, the first thing I wanted to do was push my stomach out to get up, but I'm actually going to try to force my low abs in so that I can touch more of the C shaper as I come up. And then you can't go too far like you can on the roll up and cheat. You actually get stuck. And then I'm going to pull my stomach back to push me down and go into the C shaper. So I really am fighting to not use my legs so I can feel that my legs want to get light. So I have to push them down into the floor more. And then I push them into the floor to help me find my stomach. Similarly to pushing your feet into the foot bar to do your footwork or your stomach massage. So I'm going to push my feet into the floor to help me connect to my stomach. And then I push my feet into the floor to help me go back. And you do three to five of those and you just keep feeling like, are you, when you go back, skipping your lower back? Or when you come up, skipping your lower back? Or when you come off here, is it like one flat piece and your feet come up? Right? It really does teach you a lot. So I hope you enjoy this. If you have wool access to one of these, play around with it and come back because next week we are going to do our single leg circles in this Happy, and then we'll do roll like a ball and ab series in the future. I'm Leslie Logan for more videos from me. Make sure you subscribe below. And to take my online mat class, go to lesslylogampilates.com. Thank you.